Good morning, we are up and vlogging this morning. Today is Wednesday and we have princess camp all week long. So Bella's going to that today. And Natalie and I are gonna hang out and I haven't quite decided whether we're gonna go try to run errands or if maybe we're gonna go to the children's museum. We're either gonna do that today or tomorrow. I haven't decided which day yet. She'll probably decide that pretty quickly. <laughs> and other than that, that's pretty much what's on our agenda today. We're waiting for a lot of things to arrive from Amazon today. So that's exciting, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. And then I'm just gonna be working on things here around the house. So that is what's going on around here today. And I thought we'd just do a little mini vlog today. <laughs> You show me your ballerina turns? Very nice. <laughs> it's a turpid of art. <laughs> We're ready to go. Ba Natalie's got her ballerina tutu on too. With her frozen shirt. You show me your frozen shirt? Are these fruits? I have your fruit snacks right here. Let's get ready to go. She knows right where she's going. Broken. Yeah, they just they just opened. There's no one here yet. We're the first ones here. All right, let's go play. Got a pizza shop right now. Come on. Where are we going? Come on. Where are we going? He's a coal. <laughs> I'm lying. Too much. Too much. You gonna get in the truck? Too much, Mama. Too much. You mean it help drive? Come on, Mama. Gonna do some building and stacking. Gonna get the ducks. Walk straight in the water. You putting the ducks over there? Putting all the duckies over here. You getting your pizza out of there? There you go, you can cook some pizza on the stove. Oh yeah, she's soaked by the way. So we're gonna be mismatched because the dress that I have in the car is like pink and blue. Well, what are you gonna do? <laughs> Working on the car. Pizza. All right, good playing at the tot spot. Natalie got soaked, so we had to change her top. Uh, but we are going to go ahead and pick up our sister at the dance camp, and then we are going to have lunch. We are back, and we are going to have tacos for lunch. Swung through Taco Bell because I told Natalie that I would go get her tacos because she's very good. She can down the taco like nobody's business. We picked up Bella from her dance camp. She has one more day of dance camp. And she's got a bad attitude about it because it wasn't the teacher that she wanted to teach it. The teacher that she had this past year. So hopefully she snaps out of that. We're going to have a little performance tomorrow. You look very pretty in your ballet outfit. In both of your ballet outfits. So we're going to have tacos. 
So we have our tacos for lunch. Natalie's already taking hers apart apparently. I'm gonna get some forks. <laughs> this is the fruit salad I made this week. I still need to cut up the pineapple. Natalie's just eating the blackberries out of it and the strawberries. So I just cut up the pineapple and as much as it pains me to admit this, we bought the last pineapple when I had family visiting and we went into Walmart, which I don't normally shop at, and that pineapple was really, really good. And so I got this one at Target when I was there like the past week in the grocery haul, you probably saw it. And I have to admit, not quite as good. So as much as I hate to admit it because I'm not a Walmart shopper, <laughs> um, the one that we got there was better than this one. <laughs> She still seems to like it though. <laughs> Is it delicious? Yeah. <laughs> this is our crazy Jake and the Neverland Pirates Lego Island that we built yesterday. Dad! Actually yesterday we had the palm trees like up at the top. It was starting to get pretty outrageous. I'm just glad to see them playing with the Legos because it seemed like for a period of time they kind of weren't that interested in them. But we've played these for a long time the past couple days, so that's nice. So that's nice. I'll take it. You gonna put it on the top? No, it's not gonna go. And here's the other palm tree over here. I'm gonna put that back on there. Uh oh, we lost part of our island. Are you putting the sword in his hand? Yeah. I just looked down and our Anna dress has already had <laughs> casualty on it, and so. But these cheaper dresses, I mean, as much as we use them, you kind of expect that. And the girls, you guys have been wearing Anna over and over. That's the one that you guys like, isn't it? She wants to be Elsa. Yeah. We're going to be on Elsa. You're going to be Anna and Elsa? I'm hoping that whenever we go back to Disney World that maybe they'll have the Anna and Elsa dresses in stock at that point. Maybe we can find the actual official Disney ones or whatever, but for now, these are working. I'm just happy that the stores finally got these in stock. What do you want to do with Jake? You want to have him go down the slide? Should put all the flowers on there? The palm trees and the flowers are definitely the big hits on this thing. So the kids are laying down taking the rest and I think what I'm going to do is actually start prepping to make the wreath that I bought the stuff for yesterday that you guys have probably watched the haul directly before today. If you didn't watch the haul, basically I got some things to make a wreath for my front door. It's just burlap and chevron and I picked up a little fleur-de-lis at Michael's today. I'm gonna hot glue that to the outside or attach it somehow. So I'm going to prep the area and start getting it set up. I don't know if I'll get the whole thing done during nap time because I don't want to take the whole time during nap time to do it just because I need to edit and upload and do that whole process as well but then I'm gonna go work on the wreath project so if you watch that video which is going to be on organized with style at some point uh, that's what I'm doing today the girls are up from their naps and we're gonna run to Hobby Lobby real quick because I actually need more burlap to finish the first wreath I'm actually just gonna pick up enough supplies to do a second wreath as well I think a smaller one that I'm gonna hang up in here on the little door over there or one of the other doors where I have a hook so I'm gonna grab the supplies to make that as well and then we'll be back in a minute well that was a fun trip I actually ended up getting a another wreath and I actually saw a picture that was on sale that I didn't see when we were there a couple days ago that I ended up getting for the master bedroom so I'll show you everything that we got like a mini haul <laughs> whenever we get home and that'll be um, we may try to go to a home store tomorrow but then that'll probably be like the extent of what I get right now but I'm going to make another wreath and I'm very excited about it because I started making it earlier and I'm uploading that as a separate video which I'll link down below once that video is uploaded um, but it looks really cute it's almost done it's oh, really really cute good job all right so we're gonna head home all right, so at Hobby Lobby, I got some of this blue burlap. I'm gonna make a smaller wreath with that. I got some of this fall burlap because it was on sale. It's just extra to have on hand and possibly use with the blue. 
I got some more of the burlap that I used previously on the other wreath just to finish off the end of it. I'm not going to be able to, or I'm not going to have to use that much of it, but I just had to get some more of the same kind. So I got that. I got a smaller wreath, and this is what I'm planning on putting either on our basement door, or no, it's our um, coat door over there that has a wreath hanger on it, or the pantry door, one of those. I'm going to do the blue on that. And then I found this really cute picture. I hadn't seen this when I was in there previously, and all these pictures were 50% off. And again, everything that I got today was actually on sale, so that was cool. I printed off another 40% off coupon, and I ended up using it on this, so everything was on sale. And I got this really pretty picture that has trees and birds, and it says love on it, and I thought this would be perfect for our master bedroom. And I thought this would go nicely with the new duvet cover that I got from Amazon, which was in the Amazon box, so I'll hopefully remember to show that to you guys as well. So I'm gonna go film the end of this wreath and get that done, and then I will show you guys what's in the Amazon box. Ha <laughs> ha, I love it, it's so cute. I'm not keeping it there. This is too big for that spot, obviously, but I'm gonna go put this on the front door. But that is the finished wreath, I love it. All right, so I make pork carnitas for dinner, so I'm gonna start getting this ready to go, and the girls are gonna play in the playroom. All right, so here's the beef carnitas, and I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the plates, and the girls are also gonna have some fruit salad. We've got some chips. I need to figure out what we have for dip. <laughs> I want to make some guacamole next week, but I don't think I have enough avocado to make guacamole for everyone. I need to check, actually. Well, the recipe called for three avocados, and I only had one in the refrigerator, so we're just gonna try a smaller, condensed version of the guacamole and see how it goes. All right, well, that's gonna have to do. It's actually not half bad, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of this on the plates with the chips. And that is dinner, pork carnitas with beans and then also some chips and guacamole on the side. So that is it for the evening. I'll show you real quick what came from Amazon. We got this really sifty litter box, which seems pretty cool so far. And hooray, I finally remembered to order the laminators. So I got one of these Purple Cows laminators. I also got this Pinzon bedding. I really, really love this. I think this is gonna go with our room really great. So that is what came in our Amazon order. So if you guys enjoyed today's vlog, and thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.